Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Path number seven. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this message. So today everyone, I am here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Sagittariuses who are watching. So if you have Sagittarius as your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. Your person Sagittarius is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation and communication, maybe at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and get started with your reading Sagittarius, please keep in mind that this will be a general reading for the sign of Sagittarius. So it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. All right, Sagittarius, so without further ado, before we go ahead and get into your channeled messages, we're going to pull some Moonology Oracle cards to see what energy you're dealing with at this time or the energy that's coming towards you. So let's see what we have for Sagittarius, please. Can we please get a few cards for Sagittarius? What energy is coming towards Sagittarius? Go ahead and take this first one that came out, Sagittarius, and that is emotions are running high, super moon. Okay, let's see what else we have to match this energy, please, for Sagittarius. A time for healing, balsamic moon. Okay, let's get one more card for Sagittarius, please, regarding this energy. What else does Sagittarius need to know? What other energy is coming towards Sagittarius? We also have the end of a tough cycle approaches, full moon in Capricorn. Okay, Sagittarius, so we have emotions are running high, super moon, a time for healing, balsamic moon, and the end of a tough cycle approaches full moon in Capricorn. So for some of my Sagittariuses out there, you and this person may have been butting heads. Maybe there's some things that have been brought up that has caused emotions, maybe even actions that have caused emotions that are are not the 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 best for you and this person to really come together and synchronize with one another so for some of my Sagittarius is out there we have a time for healing maybe you have just distanced yourself from this person so they will not mess with your energy what you have going on for yourself um you and this person may may have had a break or on are on a break between one another um, because the love that you have, you want that to remain, but at this time, maybe you two aren't seeing eye to eye, this person isn't understanding you, or maybe you can't just, you can't agree with how they're being, the, the actions and how they're expressing themselves in this connection. So we have a time for healing. So I feel like that may have caused for some distance to happen between you and this person. Maybe you two are in separation. But I, I feel like for you, Sagittarius, with the emotions are running high, you know when to pull away so something does not distract you so much. So you could keep your best interest for yourself, Sagittarius. So always keeping yourself first here. But we do have the end of a tough cycle approaches, full moon and Capricorn. Maybe there's a resolution that's, that's coming out with this person like this person may be expressing themselves or expressing an apology or maybe even a way or a plan to make things better so with that Sagittarius let's go ahead and get some specific messages and get into your reading all right let's go ahead and see what we have for Sagittarius what does Sagittarius need to know about this person What's this person's energy like at this time, please? Okay, Sagittarius, we have two cards that came out. 
Let's go ahead and get a few more messages for Sagittarius regarding this person. Okay. We'll take this card right here. We'll take this card as well. We're, we'll read this as an extra message. I savor every moment with you. I always think about the next time I will see you. So if you two are, are at a distance from one another, that doesn't mean that you don't want to come back to one another. It's like you, you just don't want to ruin the energy and the connection and the bond that you two have created. And sometimes that's, that's good when you want to keep something stable. Um, that also, to me, it shows recognizing those personal boundaries and, and respecting them as well. All right, so let's go ahead and get one more card for Sagittarius. One more specific message here. Okay, Sagittarius. So we have our first few cards here. Let's see what we have. We have, you can let your guard down with me. I'm not going anywhere. We also have, you're everything I want in a person. Why would I leave? I apologize if you hear some background noise right now. We also have, life got better for me when you came in. We will get there in time. And in the meantime, we will build the love we've always wanted. I know what I want for myself. Don't try to put ideas in my head. And we both had to move on for the best. You'll see that soon. Okay. So I do apologize for the typo on this card, Sagittarius. But you'll see that soon. We both had to move on for the best. We're going to start with this card right here, Sagittarius. Like I said in the beginning, I feel like maybe you and this person are on a break or in separation. Maybe this is a person that you would have loved for everything to work out with, but at the time it wasn't right and you weren't about to let their low vibrations, if they did have low vibrations, enter or affect what you had going on for yourself. So it's like two people respecting one another enough to give some space and if it's meant to be it'll be for now we need to focus on ourselves maybe mature a bit more um, maybe this person had to do some maturing or just be ready for this connection and to take it seriously and to think about your actions and your your feelings involved with theirs so I, I feel like you two may be at separation but it the door is still open here I know what I want for myself. Don't try to put ideas in my head. I do feel like this is your energy, Sagittarius, and maybe you were the one to pull away from this person um, because you're not about to let someone mess up what you have going on for yourself, like I've been saying, Sagittarius. And you, this is also when it comes to maybe someone downplaying your love, giving you what you don't deserve. You know exactly what you deserve, Sagittarius. So if it's anything less than, if it's anything messing with your own energy, Feel like you're choosing yourself we do have life got better for me when you came in i feel like this is this person's energy to you sagittarius they they do want to make it work with you and if it has been a long time they hope that the love is still there and it could be built upon um but i i feel like this person they feel as though they needed to release something or just be more ready and capable of maintaining this connection with you if they wanted to see you happy Sagittarius because they kept in mind that it's not just Sagittarius putting in the work here it's me also and what I put into this connection does affect Sagittarius so when I'm being like this when this connection is rocky Sagittarius isn't going to come or show up as the most positive <clears throat> excuse me the most positive happiest person because I might be affecting Sagittarius's mood so this person did not want to pull you down with them pull you in with them Sagittarius they want to maintain this life got better for me when you came in they want to keep you happy this connection happy it being on the on the up and up so that they could still have this to look forward to so it it doesn't 
ruin the the specialty that this bond that this connection creates i hope that makes sense sagittarius we do have you can let your guard down with me i'm not going anywhere i do feel like this might be your energy sagittarius also mutual energy but i i feel like you sagittarius this is what you offered this person when you two were connected just express yourself with me be honest with me like if there was any tension that this person brought into this connection that had nothing to do with you Sagittarius it's like help me help you like let me know what's on your mind let me know why you're being like this so I don't take it personally and even if I know not to take it personally there's still a certain way to treat somebody I am not the root of your issues you know that I know that but I'm willing to help you and understand you through them. Let me just go ahead and refer to these cards. We have a time for healing. The end of a tough cycle approaches. And emotions are running high. So yeah, with the time for healing, maybe this person was healing when they met you, Sagittarius. But still some of their energy that they were trying to release transferred onto you. And you just wanted to be a confidant. But you didn't want to be the person who was stepped on along the way. That may or may not resonate for you Sagittarius we have we will get there in time and in the meantime we'll build the love we've always wanted I feel like this is a mutual energy here Sagittarius your person's energy coming through also but knowing that everything isn't going to be perfect right away sometimes you'll have your ups and downs with one another but I'm still in this with you I still want to contribute to this i still want to be better for this and in the end we'll see that it was all worth it because there will be a beautiful drastic change here you're everything i want in a person why would i leave i feel like this is your person's message to you their energy towards you sagittarius they don't want this to leave their life they don't want you going anywhere i feel like they plan on coming back to your they they feel as though well, I won't state it like that. They they would love to come back to you if you're open to that, Sagittarius. This was not an end-all, be-all situation for this person. And I, I feel like for some of my Sagittarius is out there, this was more of a mutual thing. Like, this is not working right now. We're not going to force it, so let's walk away. All right, let's see what else we have for Sagittarius here. What else does Sagittarius need to know? Okay. We'll get one or two more cards, please, for Sagittarius. Let's go ahead and get one more card, please. Okay, Sagittarius, we have my feelings for you overflows the cup. I do apologize for this typo as well, if you notice it. We have heart of gold. Don't let your beauty go to waste for me or for anyone. And I'm falling in love with every bit of you. So Sagittarius, with this energy overall, I feel like this person cherishes you. They adore you. You're very special to them in their heart. They respect you, Sagittarius. And with the don't let your beauty go to waste for me or for anyone, they know that you need to maintain yourself. You need to do what's best for you. So... If I'm the one giving you the issue, then set me in my place, walk away, do what you need to do because you're too beautiful of a person to be down, especially if I'm the one causing the issue. I feel like this person really appreciates you, Sagittarius. Um, it's that feeling they, they love you more than they let on because it's maybe what you've done for them, what you've shown them, even teaching them things. Even if it was not your your intention to teach them, what they absorb from you, Sagittarius, it, it feeds into them. Like they, they take a lot of things from you because you're you're just a strong character that they look up to in a way. But we do have heart of gold. I feel like this is your person's energy to you, Sagittarius. Just someone who's indestructible and that goes into the, 
the content of your character, a stand-up person, Sagittarius. And I feel like they, they admire and appreciate how you handled this situation if this does resonate with you. You just choosing yourself, moving forward, maybe not letting your feelings out towards them. Um, but you, you maybe kept it short and sweet with this person. My feelings for you overflows the cup. I feel like this is their energy to you, Sagittarius. There's so much love that they want to give and express to you. And I, I feel like they've been working on it. They've been working on expressing it in the right way. And they're coming forward or they're now ready to release their feelings with you. And we have the end of a tough cycle approaches. I'm ready to put love into this and have it be more lighthearted but serious and easy with you i'm falling in love with every bit of you i feel like this is your person's message to you sagittarius all right sagittarius let's go ahead and see what sign you might be dealing with can we please get a sign for sagittarius we have cancer let's get another sign please for sagittarius taurus let's get one more sign please for sagittarius in Aries. All right, Sagittarius, I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And I will talk to you next time. Bye.